สวัสดีค่ะ Look at this jalapeno and cheddar sandwich loaf. Look at the layer of yummy. I'm gonna make milk bread, and I'm gonna add 200 gram of my starter. Three eggs. And then I'm gonna add 300 gram of milk. Two hundred gram of milk. I add uh, two hundred gram. Then I'm gonna add about thirty gram. Oops, eighty gram. It's gonna be so sweet. And then it's milk, eighty gram, and I'm gonna put everything into the pot. Mix well and then we're gonna add into the pot. Before I forget, I'm gonna add 20 gram of salt into the ingredient first. I'm gonna whisk all the ingredient well before I add into the pot. Put all the ingredient mixture into the pot. I'm gonna add the flour. And then press start. I am adding 60 gram of butter, but I'm gonna add three parts. So first part, and then two. This is my jalapeno and cheddar cheese that I chopped it. After the dough being rolled out into rectangle thinly, then you spread jalapeno and cheddar cheese chopped that you prepared earlier and go ahead spread out all over to make sure it's uh, evenly uh, dis distributed. And then cut into eight part with your knife and make sure the cheese and jalapeno is distributed into every pieces of the uh, dough. Then you gently put the dough on top of each other like that to create the layer of dough and uh, inclusion. So when you make the bread, you will have the inclusion separate into every layer of your and then go ahead to put into your tin this time I have two tin one is small like that and then I have about four or five layer just to squeeze it out and to make sure it is uh, equal size of your tin so this way I have about uh, four layer and then gently press into the tin that you've been uh, brushed with uh, butter. If you have parchment paper, please do so because it's very difficult to remove the bread after it's been baking uh, because the cheese has been melted. And then the rest of the dough, I just uh, trying to put into the big loaf. This one is uh, 12 inch long and six inch high and five inch uh, wide 
Now make sure every layer of your jalapeno and uh, dough is distributed into the tray or tin equally. Make it equal and balanced. This time I put in three different layer. I don't roll it out because when I load it out, it's very difficult to rise in the middle. So I just cut and put on top of each other like that. And then when the the dough rise, the uh, the crumb is so beautiful and very wide open. If I roll it out into the uh, roll, it's very tight crumb. So I prefer the crumb to be uh, bigger. So this way is quite nice. And then uh, after I let it prove about uh, almost full, I've been preheat to over 180 degrees Celsius for about half hour. And then I baking my uh, milk bread or brioche dough or enriched dough uh, for about 30 minutes or until the dough has rise uh, fully on top of the tin. And this is, you can see this rise up. And that's you go. Uh, there you go. You have a nice and beautiful golden color. If you find that your dough is getting dark, you can cover with the uh, parchment paper during your baking. There you go. Yummy, beautiful jalapeno and cheddar sandwich loaf. Look at the crumb and see the layer of yummy bread and jalapeno and cheddar. Uh, I slide it up and store it like that. So when I want to eat it, I just put one piece at a time into the toaster. This is yummy bread. I hope you enjoy my video and follow my recipe. See you next time.